has this story. Good morning, Ariel. Good morning to you, Cecilia. So many people are talking about this. Bonnie Jacobson says she is not an anti-vaxxer. She just wanted more time to do research on the vaccine's possible effects on fertility. I was shocked. I couldn't believe it. This morning, New York City waitress Bonnie Jacobson speaking out days after losing her job. The events of the last few days, it's it's been a roller coaster, and I have my reservations about fertility. So I want to make it very clear, you know, I'm not an anti-vaxxer. And Pfizer has launched its clinical trial in pregnant women, and SART, which is the organization for fertility doctors, says that it does recommend the vaccine for pregnant women and women trying to get pregnant. Cecilia? Okay, Ariel, I think so many people are going to have real questions about this. So what is the bottom line advice from legal experts that you're talking to? So legal experts say, of course, this is a very thorny issue. There can be exemptions for medical reasons, possibly for religious reasons as well. But as you heard there in the piece, Cecilia, legal experts say there is legal ground for employers to require the vaccine. Cecilia? Okay, Ariel, thanks so much. Michael? All right.